Come on, England! We were 4 0 up against Panama two games ago, just before half time. Come to me, an epiphany. Get the tattoo, and we will bring it home. So that's what I went out and did. So next morning, I went and got this. This is England 2018 World Cup winners. And uh, yeah, I've not looked back since. Do you know what? I'm not going to lie. Um, I've had a queue of people waiting for us to get knocked out. I've had a queue of people waiting to say that England will get beat by Colombia all over, you know, social media. All I've done is block them. Anybody that's doubting being negative. I was extremely nervous last night. I'm not going to lie. Everybody's faith is tested at some point, you know, even mine. But, um, yeah, it was just unbelievable. Saving them penalties last night. I was sat there, could loom my flag like a little kid to cuddling his teddy and uh, yeah it was just unbelievable and I've never honestly it's been a, such a long time since I had such a good night last night we're all climbing lamppost in the street and, I mean some of them photographs I sent you yeah, it were unbelievable it was probably one of the best nights I've ever had staying as it is we're winning anyway we're going to win it 100% them Swedish in the next round they want to stick to Ikea they want to go to Ikea today but they're all hanging about down there yeah let me go buy some uh, See if I can spot the team line up in there. But sweet bar, uh, Swedish meatballs are off the menu. IKEA's off the menu. Sweden's blacklisted until after the next round. So in two thousand and in in nineteen sixty six, when England won the last World Cup, Man City came top of the league. Burnley came into the European places. Chelsea came fifth in the league. And Real Madrid won the European Cup. All them happened in 1966, and all them have happened this year as well. The Germans are out, the Spanish are out, the Argentines are out, and they're just giving us a clear route to the final. Everybody at England is 100% behind you, boys. The same commitment and effort that you're putting in out there, I'm putting in at the pub. Every time you do a sprint, I'm doing a shot. Every time you do a long pass, I'm having a pint, so uh, yeah, I'm definitely putting my hard yards in for team as well, don't worry about that. I'm going to go pick my little girl up and I'm going to take her out for some food and I'm going to tell her that your dad were right and that your daddy told you England were going to bring the World Cup home this year. <laughs>